All right, guys, and welcome back to Wednesday Night Fights, uh, episode 13, but this is the winter season of Vitrix, week number eight. This is the season finale. Man, I just mixed those names up. Didn't I? <laughs> the Vitrix winter season finale, week number eight. There it is. Boom. Okay. Oh, man. Long time no see, but we're ready for some Street Fighter Alpha 2 Top 8 action. Yes. Uh, these... This top eight is gonna be pretty interesting because we got some uh, a couple new guys and of course some of the uh, top eight favorites. But before you know we go into that, we want to you know give a shout out to the the peoples that have made it possible uh, for supporting the season. Uh, starting off with Vitrix, the the winner of the uh, winter season of Alpha Two. It's going to win this headset. This is the Pro AF ANC. This is the premium version of uh, the headset, as you can see with the control console there. Uh, it's got noise canceling. It's, I, I just want, I, you know what? I, <laughs> I just want to see, I think it's it's John and, oh, well, we'll get in there. So it's going to be John and OC Rider. But I, I want to see them try this out. They really, truly try this out. Um, you know, I, I can only imagine when they're just messing with the stuff and they, and, and without a care in the world, it's actually really, really good. If you guys haven't had premium headsets, I highly recommend these ones. So uh, that, and of course, uh, our, our friends at MetaView. So MetaView has made it possible for uh, for us to get these amazing highlights and clips uh, that we have at Wednesday Night Fights. And they're curated and going to be delivered tomorrow uh, around noontime. On the metaview.gg site, we have a week a Wednesday Night Fights weekly best moments uh, section, uh, where you, if in case you know you guys don't want to watch the whole thing, you can only watch bits and pieces. This is what it's there for, and it also helps the players to get a, a bit more visibility. Um, you know, either from the tweets, uh, from obviously from the stream, uh, or you know, it carries on the next day. So it's it's really cool that they're doing this, not just for us, but for various FGC events out there. For more information, check out the description below. You can click on MetaView and you can check out a lot of highlights. If you're like if you like TikTok and all those type of sites that you can take bite-sized clips of things, this is actually pretty cool to see. All right, so let's talk about our top eight that we have here. Uh, top eight for Wednesday Night Fights, starting off with Choi Boy and Volcanic Akuma. That's going to be a Ken Mirror match. If they play their mains. Well, Choi, of course. If Choi plays his main, it's definitely Ken. And Volcanic Kuma is a resident Ken player as well. He's, he's been improving throughout the throughout the season. And it's cool to see him in the winner side of Top 8. Because he has been coming through the loser side uh, a lot of times. So it's great to see him in tip-top shape. Uh, and coming up next after that is OC Ryder versus Hokuto. Uh, this is well. This is uh, becoming a bit of a rival match now too, where uh, old school and new school are you know battling out more often. Um, and Hokuto has also uh, been improving his Sakura a lot. And OC Rider, the most consistent player that we have here, <laughs> top three every time or just about. So that's that's going to be a fabulous match. Uh, and next up, then we have Green Joker. Uh, Versus Veritas. So Green. Okay. So unfortunately, Veritas won't be able to make it uh, tonight. So Green Joker is gonna get awarded a buy. But I just want to talk about Green Joker a little bit. Green Joker uh, gave John a run for his money. He's an amazing Rolento player. Really good. Very aggressive. Very actually neutral orientated. He doesn't do a lot of like the jump away gimmicks and stuff and and charge up. He actually does play neutral with you, uh, which you know. I cheese it out. You know, I try to get my meter, but, you know, he actually plays Street Fighter with the character, which is a bit refreshing to see going in and doing his things. He knows the customs, uh, knows the matches really well, so he, he's going to be the, the one to see, like, Dark Horse of the tournament for sure. Uh, then we have... Can you read these things? Uh, Saber versus Onagai. Saber, top 8 competitor here now. Resident top 8 competitor every time he plays with us. It's always a pleasure to see him play. Uh, he's got a mixed bag of characters from like Rolento. Um, he can play Dalsum. Um, and, man, you know, actually, I may not know all of his characters, but 
he, because of he's OG. OGs usually have a lot of mixed bag characters, but those two in particular are his main ones uh, that he uh, brings out to terrorize people with. Uh, and he's going to be playing versus Onagai, which is our resident Akuma player. And it's great to have Akuma player in uh, playing with us because Akuma is in, in the A tier of characters. Uh, you know, it's not easy, an easy win. It's just that he has all the tools, though, offensively and defensively to make your life hell. And Onagai does have the customs down and can bring you some hell if you let him. All right, so let's get into the first match, yeah? So we're gonna have let's go choi 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 go 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 oh yes you sad no sodom players hey, you know why don't you enter the tournament so you can be the sodom player right that's what we did back then you know we're like hey how come this how come there's no whatever player or no 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 representation no representation from this character i'll enter next time gotta gotta be in there dude gotta gotta put yourself out there no slam town, yeah. No slam town on this one. Uh, all right, here we go. Volcanic Akuma and Choi Boy is getting situated in the game. Let's get them going. Let's get it popping. Right, this is gonna be classic Ken Ken. Oh, that's right. Slam town forgot to enter. <laughs> that's true. Yeah. Sign-ups close at 6.30. Sign-ups close at 6.30. Yeah. So it is. All right. So, yeah, we do got the mirror match. So what is Volcanic Akuma going to do to get across the wall of John? John Choi's got prob probably the biggest wall ever created by Ken in this game. Look at this. You, you cannot... You can... Y'all shall not pass! My goodness, dude. Already, that is some high damage. And John has the meter uh, lead as well, so you can, you can start alpha countering if he wants. Alright, good jump in by Volcanic Akuma. Customs are ready and locked and loaded. Oh, there was this opportunity! Because he done it! No, oh, too far, too far. Hmm. I do like the aggressiveness, though. So. Oh, nice jump in. John throwing too many fireballs. John doesn't want to use the meter. Okay, he does now. Will it kill? No, it won't. Cross, yeah. See, everybody's afraid to tech roll after the custom, but that's where John gets you the most. Like, John knows that like you're so scared to tech roll because you're kind of right next to him. <laughs> Yo, my man Sprite Mix dropping the Discord. If you guys want to get into the Alpha 2 community, go ahead and join my man Sprite Mix's uh, Discord for all the tips and tricks and the ma battle matches you'll get from everybody. John Choi Wall is approaching. Look at this. My yo. So John just finished playing a Grand Finals match in Super Turbo. This, he is playing upset right now because he didn't win that tournament. Look at him. Yo, he is playing super nice. Yeah, Volcanic Kuma's got to figure out this puzzle. Oh no! Oh my God! Level three super, and you're in the corner. Oh, uppercut. Oh, sweep his ass. That's right. Oh, and you're dizzy. And you're dizzy because the game tells you so. My goodness. Damn, just like that, man. This game is blazing speeds, man. Blazing speeds of 56k. Remember when that shit was announced as blazing fast speed? Get it now. 56k. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Remember that? That was the shit, bro. <laughs> yo, look at the life. Oh, Lord. Yo, the wall. The Great Wall of Choi. My goodness, dude. Ended up with the super just like that. Yo, John wants his Boba money and dip. This is the, this is the speed run edition. You don't think you got internet until DSL came out? Ah, uh, that's your bad, dude. Tadouken! Uppercut. John has not missed one yet. Okay, nice jump, Tatsu. You're in there. No alpha counter. He wants to wait. Uh, he wanted to save his custom, but didn't work. 
Didn't work. He may have one more chance with the level one custom. No, nope, there it is. Overhead. John was ready. He alpha countered him in the nuts to take it. Man. <laughs> alpha counter in the nuts. Boom. Botazo. <laughs> got him. We got him. All right. So John takes that 3 0 with a quickness. Volcanic Akuma is still in the tournament. It's all good. You still live to fight another day? You just gotta remember that who cares if he's a wall just throw fireballs in his face too you know how many times that i played this guy and i'm just sitting there we're not jumping it's just a it's a game of chicken on the ground right and then whoever gets that jump we're just throwing a bad fireball that's the game that's that's the game okay so you're not gonna win every encounter but like go ahead just like experiment by throwing bad fireballs Find out what a bad fireball is, you know, to them. Because everybody has a different like, perspective of what is a bad fireball. Because so, some people are like, oh, that long-range fireball, bad fireball. I don't know. Just try it out. And after throwing so many bad fireballs, you start to kind of figure out the timing to turning it into a good fireball. So it, it's that's just the way it works. It's trial and error. That's, that's all I'm trying to say. All right. Next up is Hokuto. Are they in the match? Not much. Go, 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 go. Yep, you hear what I'm saying. Yeah, dude, like, uh, I, I can tell you firsthand, uh, I wasn't the best, not even near the best at throwing fireballs, okay? But what I was good at is whiff punishing and forcing a reaction, okay? So I had a. I had to manipulate space and pretend that I was going to jump. And then my fireballs turn in, you know, my fireballs started to turn into like uh, normals. <laughs> if that makes sense. It, it, it just no longer became, uh, all right, let me clear this up real quick. Whoa. I didn't put their names up there yet. Huh. What am I doing, man? All right, here we go. But anyways, I was just saying that the fireballs that I started to throw, um, I made them look like my normals. You know, it's, it's just I started getting good at that versus trying to zone. The zone, I, I would never or rarely win a zone war against uh, people that were good at fireballs. So I had to be a little bit more creative. Oh, over. Ooh, there it is. Yep. So I like the pick by OC Rider using Guy. I, I, yeah, because th this match is is hard for S Sakura. It, you know, obviously it's hard for her to cross Guy up, and that's Sakura's main pressure tool. And uh, OC Rider knows that that's, you know, if he gets knocked down, he he'll be able to escape the uh, the cross up situation. Nice. Oh, oh. Where's the super? Nice overhead. All right. So question here now is, who's gonna whiff who? Because oh, guys, custom. Oh, super? No super. Yeah, guys, custom is far reaching. Oh. Oh, okay. That was weird. But Hokuto got the exchange there. Uh, uh, alpha counter. No. Ace, no anti-air customs by uh, OC Rider, but he got this one anyways. Right, kick, the kick throw. Nice, wow. He did Tatsu over the custom. Kashi me to kick for the win. A little scrambly this match, that's for sure. A little, little bit of scrambly. But guys got amazing tools in this match. Standing medium kick outranges uh, Sakura's pokes. Uh, guy can also walk past or walk under Sakura's jumps, so he's got a lot of stuff. The only thing he can't do is he he can't do standing hard punch uh, versus a standing Sakura. It whips or sorry, crouching Sakura. There's a few characters in Alpha Two where Guy can't do standing fierce, and that's uh, versus Sakura. So you have to do crouching fierce if you want to go into elbow. Oh, nice. Big throw. 
crash meeting could meet him. Yeah, we'll see Ryder making this look pretty easy so far. I wouldn't say easy, but more in control. Okay, cross up Z. No, no cross up Z. It's hard. Normally, if that was any other, like, like a, even a Shoto, Shoto would have to think about the ambiguous from there. The punishment with the custom. Ah, you rolled. That's the consequence if you roll. All right, but now Hokuto has no meter. No meter. Ryder can come in there and custom just like that. No, he did standing fierce. He whiffed because he did standing fierce. It's exactly what I was talking about. That whiffs versus a crouching Sakura. Cross off opportunity? No, it's just too hard. Enjoys, uh, I'll enjoy. Uh, <laughs> OC Ryder is not getting the conversions here. Ah, got the pushing grab. Crouching medium kick. Oh, good block. Nice, off the counter. Punch off the counter for the win! Yeah, oh man, he is going straight counter picking. Yo, OC Ryder is throwing off the gloves though. Yo, you you calling this a rivalry match? No, let me counter pick this guy real quick. I'll show you a rivalry match. <laughs> My man. Hmm, it's more like guys' hitboxes all the way over here instead. Yeah. <laughs> he 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 be a skinny ninja. That's who that's who he be. Yep. And you gotta custom combo the Bushin flips. You see that? Oh, that's a good punish. See it? Yeah, standing medium kick custom activation with guy is probably the best with punishing custom in the game, hands down. Oh wow, what a Bushin grab from far. And look already, man, OC Ryder is just one round away from moving forward. Yeah, he oh wow, he already started the custom. If, if Hokuto would have flinched, I would have hit. That's the bunny conda special. He loves doing custom from the from the start. Oh, uh, still a custom on wake up. Nice. He's mixing up overhead and crouching medium kick. Again? Crouching medium kick. Overhead? Nope. <laughs> wow, he's got his own vortex too. Oh, okay, he got the he got the cross up, but it got it got blocked. Made a conversion anyways. No, that that's definitely not the play there. It's very easy to block. Hmm. Nice defense. Hope those aware. Oh, where's the anti-air customs? Super? No super. Overhead. Oh, get nice jumping custom by Hokuto to get out. Uh, but you still gotta worry about. Oh, super now? No super. Oh, he does it off of a walk under. Like I said, it's very easy. <laughs> I forget, dude. When when OC Rider play <laughs> disconnects from his match. All right, everyone down. Uh, dude, that guy just went Meh! done. Like, bro, let me close my window. Shit. <laughs> OC Ryder takes it. Uh, but what I said earlier, uh, you know, is still true. Where guy can walk under many uh, many characters' jumpins, like no like no problem. And he can go for a throw. He can go for a custom. It's like you put yourself in a 50 50 in that situation. And o OC Ryder took advantage of that. All right, so now I'm going to. Well, actually, before we move on, I gotta open up the Macharino. Yes, that. So we have a Macharino for Street Fighter Alpha Two. It's sitting at. Uh, can we refresh it real quick? Uh, fifty-six dollars and ninety-one cents. Uh, I I can't even talk right now. Highlight the promo code if you want to contribute. Highlight it. Copy this bad boy, contribute, boom, populate it in here. See that 50 cents? Hit the contribute button. Look, your contribution has been added to the price pool. Now it's at $57.41. So if you hit exclamation Macharino in the Twitch chat, you will get the link for here. And it, also there's some uh, sponsor quests on the right side. So if, uh, to help with additional pricing for the tournament. 
All right, so shout outs to Slamtown with the 1050, Saber with the 1050, Rotary Lover 89 with the $10, OC Rider with the $7.31. Like, I, I don't know, I guess the McDonald's Happy Meal price. This is some obscure ass numbers, bro. <laughs> or 60 cents from Louis IGU. All right, let's get let's get it on with some more Alpha Two matches. <laughs> hey, dude, I don't know, dude. I, I, you know, dude puts in like crazy, crazy numbers. Uh, okay, I gotta move Green Joker up to Veritas. Unfortunately, all right, we're gonna it's Saber and Onigai. Let me prep up their names real quick. So Saber and Onagai. Saber may use Rolento here, where Onagai uses Akuma. The toppest of tears. Toppest of tears. You know what's funny? I'm looking at Fightcade. I'm looking at the playing in Alpha 2. And I see Volcanic Akuma playing some dude, some dude named Salty Clams. Oh god! <laughs> I I don't know why that's funny. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. <laughs> you <Yeah. laughs> hey, dude, who are you playing? Who are you playing against, bro? I'm uh, playing against um, salty clams. <laughs> All right, here we go, Saber. He does pick. He, he picks Rolenta. Oh man, how can you get a free Pixel Pal if? Oh, you get a free Pixie Pixel Prowl if you purchase um, a Street Fighter V Vitrix stick. It comes with one. What? Right. Oh, hey, what's up, Volcanic Kakuma? How you doing, bro? <laughs> okay, here we go. They're fighting in the snow, in the rain or in the snow. Oh, you're dizzy. Is he dead? He's hella dead. Nicely done. Ona guy saw the dizzy, got the easy combo, did it. Mm. Yep, charging up like a boss. Dive kicks are really good versus Rolento. I'm just saying. Like that. Oh, good alpha counter. Get off me. Nope. Oh, great. That's too obvious of a spring. Oh, we got Akuma combos. Oh, we got Rolento combos too. You could be dead. You're definitely dead. <laughs> so we got Akuma combos. We have Rolento combos too. <laughs> we have a Hulk. <laughs> I have an army. Well, I have Rolento combos. <laughs> uh. Oh man, Crouching Fierce is brand tire. Yep, charging up. Oh no, guy, just a few hits. Oh no, that's a lot of knife. Oh, he's stuck in a throw. You got custom, custom incoming. Ah, oh, Saber couldn't, yeah, couldn't get away from the fireball. Pretty patient play from Onagai. He didn't want to burn the meter just yet. Didn't want to burn it. But man, that life bar just went disintegrate. Mm. Oh. Oh, be like water 48. Doing great, man. I just had some water. No, I am water. <laughs> it's been a great night playing some Alpha 2. Ready? I think that's, that's the new thing Rolentos are doing, right? They're jumping in customs. Interesting. You can still convert off of that, which is dope. Oh, man. Full sickle meter. Yeah. You gotta guess. You gotta guess. That is a Kuma special. We used to call those the Roly Polies. Nice jump in Tatsu. Ono guy's not playing around here. Crouching Fierce. That's good. Oh, that's a lot of life. Oh, not that much. Sweep. Get off me. 
Dude, Rolento is such a cool character, man. He's definitely one of my favorites to play in this game. He's so good. He's so good. Man, Ono got with the patience. Uh, just charging up as much as he can. Oh, custom, y'all. You are dead. Oh, you're not dead. Interesting. Okay, you're dead there. Oh. Probably wasn't his optimal choice, but I, it probably surprised him too. I'm like, wait, you're not dead? I know the most optimal of Akuma combos. <laughs> that's not how a guy talks. I'm just kind of like... I'm imagining that's how he would sound, right? All right, Saber busting out the Dalsum now. Oh, you punched that toe right back to India. <laughs> oh, shit. So who are you going to do roundhouse with me? No, get that shit back to India, bro. Like, who are you gonna try to hit from full screen, dude? God damn. <laughs> oh, there we go. Custom, custom. Oh, okay. He knows to do the quick hits. Yoga, yoga. Ooh, yoga blast. Yo, that did so much damage, dude. Oh, oh he's trying to hit more Indian fingers, dude. <laughs> you know, we call the characters by their countries, like their limbs. Uh. Uh. There we go, nicely done. Classic Dalsum uh, trade versus fireball. Crouching Fierce, love it. Yoga Flame. Yep, good. Ooh, it's saying good patience by uh, Saber, but he, he got sniped. Oh, what a jump in by uh, Volcanic, or sorry, <laughs> what's it Volcanic, it's not, not Mr. Salty Clams, but uh, on a guy. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> my bad. I was in the groove. I was in the groove. Boom. Boom. Oh, he missed him. Okay, light, light. I think on a guy was trying to custom there. He was, he was missing. He was getting frustrated. <laughs> Damn lit. <laughs> Damn, lit his ass on fire. <laughs> doom, doom, light that ass on fire. Doom, doom, light, light that ass on fire. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. All right, Saber's on the board. Oh, Sagat? <laughs> Salty Clams is coming for you. <laughs> Tiger Claw. Yo, is this a Dalsum counter? Wait, what? Let's see that. Maybe because he has a low jump. I mean, when I play this match, it doesn't really count because I'm just sick with it. But I mean, <laughs> yeah, okay. So, but normally, you know, D Dalsum has ways to get around Sagat's fireballs. Yeah, he can just jump and float. Huh? Okay, good wait. Oh, you could have got a sick combo there, but he didn't convert. Oh, he's trying to alpha counter the limbs? No, no, dude. India saved this time. Ooh! Damn, dude. He fireballed him in the pañales, dude. And his diapers. No uppercut. Didn't believe. He didn't believe. Oh, they're playing in such close quarters. Oh, no! What a jump in. That's a surprise jump in by, uh, by Ona guy. You got the cherries and everything. Hey, hey man, you cherry, bro. <laughs> no uppercut. No uppercut there either. Yeah, just waiting. Oh, yeah, look at the series of hits. Yo, Saber is just chopping away. Bob Pop. Oh, you got those? <laughs> you got slow ass jumping combos with Dalsa? Yeah, of course you do, bro. I love it. And a perfect? Sick. Sick with it, dude. How often do you see a jumping dizzy combo from Dalsa that's not a custom? <laughs> Tiger. Oh, wow. Look at. Yo, the conversion. Oh, it's his turn. Oh, he blocks. Tiger, Tiger, Tiger! Yo, what a turn of events! Yeah, I can't roll in on India, man. 
Oh, he is ready this time, dude. And and just like that, Saber ties it up 2-2. Two, two. Dang, already, dude. 2-2. Two to two. Yeah, I told you. Saber's got Rolento and Dalsam on lock. Those are his characters. Like, hey, if he can't rush you down, he'll prevent you from rushing him down with this character. Okay, here we go. On a guy back to his main. Yoga Flame! Wow. The headbutt. And a rush down Dalsum. Now he's back strong. Yo, look at all these buttons, dude. Oh, you're not dizzy yet? Okay, here we go. Damage? No damage. Oh, that's so good. Yeah. So, there's only certain custom combos that you can do versus Akuma. Because a, a lot of them, if there's any... If there's any longer gaps in customs, uh, Dawson can escape. Yeah, he, he can escape with his, uh, he has a teleport. He has a teleport tech. Yeah, look at that, see? See what I'm telling you? Too long of a gap. Hmm. Yep. Sims, Sims tech teleport does kind of change up your, your combo, um, your combo routes. It does. No, no alpha counter there. Oh, he got him! What an answer! That was amazing! Yo, Saber, you were ready for that, dude? You got two elephants and everything? Wow. Yo, hey, dude. <laughs> that was so sick. Yo, give the man a prize. He's just scored two elephants. <laughs> you gotta go take it back to, like, his millions of kids that he has at home. Papi! Wow, that was so good, dude. Saber, good stuff, dude. That was slick. He's like, oh, I see. <laughs> you would think like, okay, the guy's coming in with a demon flip. You would think, oh, let me anti-air custom. No. What does Saber do? Let me custom slide that bitch. <laughs> you imagine that, dude? Just Saber just chilling. Like, I got the slide going on, dude. <laughs> you got him, dude. That was a good match, though. The one guy played that really well, but Saber, man, he came back with the doll scene. You don't really get to see too much Dalsim action, but what you do, my man Saber, he gets it in. Okay, all right. Next up, we're gonna have oh, we're gonna have Hokuto versus Green Joker. Yeah, yeah. Let me get that in there real quick. Let me type that sucker in there. This is gonna be this is gonna be good. This is gonna be good. Go, go, go. Hokuto versus Green Joker. Let's get it. Let's get it. This is going to be Sakura versus Rolento. No, not Veritas. Oh, did I have that wrong? No, no, no. It's, it's Green Joker and you. It's Veritas DQ'd. He's not going to be here. Yeah. Eritas is a no show. Yeah, so yeah, Ver Ver Veritas uh, unfortunately can't make top eight tonight. So uh, he said to just go ahead and DQ him. Yeah, I thought I thought I mentioned that earlier, but it's a cool. I remind you guys. Yeah, we hope uh, you know you know Veritas can play with us again. He's really good uh, Chun Li player. I think he's trying to play. Uh, Shoto's now too. All right, yeah, but so this would be uh, Sakura versus Rolento, both in my A tier group of characters. Uh, in this particular match, um, Rolento could be winning the entire round, but if he gets knocked down just one time, that can be GG. Go go go. Okay, here we go. Because yeah, Rolento is a, is a fat character. Fat character. Uh, very easy to cross up. And Sakura, if she does alpha counter, that's a hard knockdown. <laughs> so you gotta... You, you, Rolento can't poke too much once uh, uh, Sakura has a meter. Oh, that's a punish. Oh, you gotta got more than that. You got a lot more than that. 
Yeah, but in the beginning of the game, it's in Rolento's favor. Just outranges her. He can whiff a crouching fierce and still anti air with standing medium punch. Okay, so now Green Joker has got to find his way to get the. Uh, oh, oh, could have got a, a custom punish there. Oh, he escapes the custom. Yep, oh, Hokuto escapes the punish. Wow, what a jump in. Oh, this is trouble. Oh, he, he didn't get the cross up. Interesting. Green Joker crouched. Is that his way of escaping it? Yeah. Word? Is that tech? Yeah, see, yeah, you can't escape that one. Nice overhead. See, that's exactly what I tell you. Like, Rolento's doing so good most of the round, and it just takes one knockdown. That's the match. This is, this is just one of those things. Yeah, okay, the knockdown. Ambiguous? No, overhead? Ah, overhead into the low. Combo. Baited the custom. Nice bait. Oh, okay, that's just gonna be pressure, and that's not gonna be a cross up. That builds so much meter for opponents. Whenever Rolento does the Patriot Circle combo, it should build almost a full bar for your opponent. Get this range. Yep, crouching fierce range, jumping medium. Yep. You gotta deal with this. Yep, cross up city. Ambiguous, and Hokuto takes game one. Uh Hmm, Ona oh, no, guy, thanks for the kind words, dude. Hey, remember Alpha 2 is still gonna be around, it's but it's gonna be on Tuesdays only now. For now, for now. You know, I just gotta be a family man for Wednesday, so I can't can't put in too many hours uh for the time being. Hadouken! Nice empty jump throw. Cross up. Yep, yeah, ambiguous is really difficult to deal with. Oh, I don't know if you try to go for the fierce intentionally because standing fierce is a terrible button for Rolento because it unblock or hit is punishable. <laughs> Makes no sense. Oh, look, look at how they're walking. Oh, you try to do alpha counter into custom. Oh, bait. Oh, okay, he almost messed that up, but he got it. He got it, got it, got it, got it. Oh, smack. Yo, getting smacked by the stick like that. Yep, gotta deal with the cross up. Ambiguous. Another one. Oh, he, he rolled right through. No anti-air customs. Yeah, nice crouching strong. Thwarted the crouch, uh, the uh, custom. Yeah, the pressure by, uh, oh man, the green, green Joker pressure was really good. But he made Hokuto use custom now. So l look at the full stick of butter that Green Joker has. If you want to see some life bar evaporate, look at this. Oh, he didn't optimize. Yeah, that's the thing. Like when you do hard kick starter, uh, you you got you got your timing has to be on point, or the character bounces too high for the next repetition. So you have to switch the buttons um, accordingly. That's why I use lights. Oh no. Yeah, lights have a more of a consistent arc and easier to the the custom. Nice anti air custom by Hokuto to tie it up. Yeah, I know uh, Hokuto has come a long way because when I used to play him, uh, Rolento versus Sakura, it, it would be really hard for him to even get one game. But when I played him maybe like a week or so ago, like, you know, he was going within like almost what? Almost back and forth. Like he's gotten, he's gotten the uh, the strategy down and, and doing alpha counters a lot versus my, my pokes. It's being very more aware and, and got his experience in that match. So, but Green Joker going for the eight on pick. 
Yeah, Adon's got a very deadly custom. Very fast, too, with Crouching Heart Kick. Yeah, but you gotta deal with Sakura's as well. Here goes Jaguar, Jaguar, Jaguar. Yep. Jaguar, Jaguar, Jaguar. Yeah, Adon's Crouching Heart Kick custom is super fast. Really, really fast. Yeah, he can take you to the corner, too, with the Jaguar Kicks. Jaguar Kick! Roundhouse, roundhouse again. Okay, nice conversion from Okuto in the corner. Baits out the custom. Nope, same side. It's too far to be ambiguous there. It's a cool stage. Cool music too. Nice crouching fierce by Okuto. Doesn't want to let him get any any footing at all to come back. Now what a match this is. Pretty even so far. Up too, yep, too far, too far to uh, try to get the ambiguous. Ah, breaks out the throw. Yeah, Green Joker is keeping his distance. It's good. Oh, oh, it rolled into custom. Oh, what a! Oh, wow, the timing of the jump from Hokuto. He baited the throw because oh my god, my goodness! Oh, that's it. 3-0. <laughs> I didn't even move the score. My bad. I, I was paying attention to the match more so than like the scores. It was it was a uh, 3-1. Sorry. Um. But yes. <laughs> Actually, no. It was 3-0. My bad. But uh, I like the way Green Joker plays uh, Rolento. Um, there, there's just you know just some things in there where. Uh, optimization of the custom just trying to get back into the groove of things because I, I I heard that he he said he's played from the old school days too so um, and I'm, I'm sure that the matches will come back to him too uh, and and I like the style of play the the distance that he plays too it shows me that he has the patience he knows Street Fighter he knows the Street Fighter fundamentals of things it's just the matchup experience and who he's playing against you know Hokuto hasn't missed a Wednesday night fight so he's he's been in uh, tip-top shape all right, so yeah, awesome play, Green Joker. Thank you, thank you so much for playing with us, man. All right, next up we got Volcanic Akuma. <laughs> I wonder if he got crazy uh, practice from Salty Clams. Ah, uh, yeah, man. Yeah, Green Joker, dude. Good, good stuff, man. Oh, you going? <laughs> Volcanic Akuma told me to go, go, go. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, sup, GGs. Love it, dude. Oh, yeah. So we're just waiting for Saber and Volcanic Akuma to get their uh, match in the lobby. So this should be Ken versus, you know, maybe even Dalsum. So we're waiting for Saber. The white patch, I look in like Guts from Berserk. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I'm in my 40s. You know, us, us old, old timers, have, you know, start to either lose hair, get white hairs, or try, try to... <laughs> Try to look hip, but doesn't work out. So they start growing crazy mustaches and beards. Hmm. Yep, I called it. Ken versus uh, Dalsum. All right, here we go. Yoga fire. Lee. Oh, nice Yoga Blast uh, custom combo. Yeah, this is going to be one bit of a, slog a slobber knocker match. The Saber has to try to get away from Ken. Ken is the bulldog here. He can do so much damage in such a little such a little time. Oh, Saber tried to get the unblockable. Hmm. 
You know, Dalsum has an unblockable Yoga Flame. Depending uh, from a certain distance, like if he does it meaty, I don't know the the science behind it, but I know it's unblockable versus some characters. It's so cheap. Hmm. Oh, he uppercutted that. You know where? Back to India. <laughs> there, oh, that's a lot of that's a lot of blood. Oh, that's, that's definitely a lot of blood with the alpha counters. Oh, I love it. I love it. Oh, and he did the punishment there, too. Yo, Volcanic Akuma. There you go, dude. Yo, maybe the matches with Salty Clams, you know, gave him the experience that he was looking for. That's all he needed. Salty, salty Clams in his dish. Hmm. It's only against Zangief. I believe he did that. I think he does that versus Sodom too. Hmm. <laughs> no, salt, dude. I was telling you guys for reals, for reals. Volcanic Akuma was playing somebody named Salty Clams in in Fight Cave Lobby while another match was going on. But it doesn't matter because Saber, Salty Clams or not, Saber is on the board. <laughs> yes. Yo, Sa Saber is playing really good with Dalsum, man. Yo, got fire. Oh, yes. Get sniped. Yo, got fire. The token. Slides. No, no rolls for you, buddy. Oh, man. That's so good. That's so good. Yo, Dalsum. Saber has not dropped that at all. Yo, we are getting some Dalsum representation here, dude. I re I never get hyped for Dalsum. I, I I never get hyped for this character, but Saber, you know, he's showing us a light here. Because this man struggles. This character hella struggles in this game. Like look at the look what he has to deal with, right? Like we're saying, oh poor poor Dalsum. And then he does this. <laughs> See, Dalsum, no, Dalsum players did not know that he had a custom like that in the 90s. Nope. <laughs> you know what kind of customs Dalsum did back then? Just fireball, fireball, regular fireball in the corner. <laughs> fireball, fireball. Yo, 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 yo. <laughs> and with a couple fierces at the end. That was their custom. Man, look at this pressure. Yo, okay, he knows meaties that way? Yo, Saber. Ooh, uppercut again. Yo, that did a lot of life. Two of those? It's alpha two. Oh, da, 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 da. <laughs> he did the Jeff Schaefer. <laughs> you know, Jeff Schaefer's custom combo is mashing strong and then an uppercut at the end. John, John remembers that shit. <laughs> you can see that shit in the B3 video. The Jeff Schaefer. Hmm. <laughs> Yo, it's so weird when somebody jumps in on Dalsum. And Dalsum doesn't just do crouching strong. I'm thinking he's going to get the Alpha 2 crouching strong. <laughs> for anti-air. I've seen it so many times, right? It's totally different after anti-air buttons. Yo, Saber is playing super good until he gets hit by this. Oh, wow! What a timing difference! Oh, no! That sucks! That sucks so much for Volcanic Akuma, dude! <laughs> oh, shit! I'm telling you, your, your customs and your combos, the combo routes have to change. Like you're just comp because of that the teleport. Damn, dude. Wow. Oh no, that sucks, dude. Imagine if that happened to you in tournament. Oh yeah, this is a tournament. <laughs> really? Like, Yo, that's just broken. What would we say about? Oh, that's broken, bro. You can't combo you, dude. That's broken. <laughs> Saber, dude. Good shit, man. Saber is playing really nice this tournament. 
He's showing us the Dawson potential. Oh man! Oh, and he has to now. He has to deal with Lord Hokuto and his crazy Sakura. And you know Saber is not gonna go for Rolento in this match. He hates Rolento versus Sakura. He hates that match. He hates it. He hates it. He hates it. Go go go. Hmm. Yeah, Hokuto is going to of course pick. Uh, his favorite Sakura and Saber has to pick. Well, he's most likely gonna pick Dawson. It'd be a big surprise if he picks Rolento here. Telling them to go, go, go. It's waiting for their match. Sim so dirty, he got his <laughs> message deleted. I don't know. I think uh, Hokuto is praying. To the lords of cross-ups right now. Maybe Hokuto went to the bathroom. Maybe. Alright, so anyways. If they're uh, if they're just chilling. Uh, we can talk of other things. Like. Uh, uh, if you guys didn't hear the news. Oh, well. I'll tell you about the news. <laughs> they're in the game now. I was going to talk about Super Turbo and Alpha 2. Uh. That they're they're going to Tuesdays starting next week. Tuesdays starting next week. All right, here we go. They're in game. They're in game. All right. While they're setting up their character, let me get some water. Water. The reserve character. Yo, Saber got the Chun Li. Okay, this is a really good anti Sakura character. You know why? Because Chun Li can also walk under Sakura. Nice, right, got great anti air, great mobility, so she can go toe to toe. Yep, too far. Hey, Goken! Hmm. Oh, no alpha counter? Oh, he didn't have it. Didn't have it. Sandy hard kick got traded. Ooh, she got punched in the no-no spot. Punched in the no-no spot. Hoka don't care. Hoka don't care, man. Long hair don't care, dude. He's he's still going on the offensive. Kind of plays his character like uh like Vega. You see, it's hard to get the ambiguous there. So this is a solid pick by Saber. You just gotta go toe to toe with this girl. You gotta go toe to toe. Oh, what a good jump in. Oh, you got the uh, <laughs> the overhead too. Oh man, what a scramble match. Good block. Oh no. And he, he did tech. I don't know. I don't know about this pick yet. It's it's it seems more of like um If if they're going hit for hit it's going to be in Hokuto's favor because Hokuto can get better combos off the scrambles than Chun-Li can. Unless chun Li's just going to go for like crouching medium kick fireball, crouching strong fireball. But Hokuto gets the knockdown. That's that's highly in her favor to get that. So yeah, if, if you're going for any type of scramble, you get knocked down like this. Oh, nice delay into roundhouse. Good block. Yeah, that's one for Hokuto. Yeah, this is how I got the score, okay? We got the score here. <laughs> of course, oh, the knee drop. Of course that hits in that direction. The big ass hitbox. Yo, Hokuto is so relentless. Look at this, he don't care. He don't care, he keeps rolling in, dude. He's so aggressive. Pop. Yeah, this is definitely a little bit more uh, respect given uh, by Saber. Just keeping his distance. Nice anti-air custom. I love it. You don't really see many Chun-Li players doing 
uh, anti air customs, but it's definitely needed. That's perfect, too. Standing light punch into it? It's amazing. Oh! It's fucking empty jump into low! Oh, what a stagger! What an amazing stagger by Hokuto to take that one. Yeah, it could have been crouching light into a throw. You know, it, it could have been anything else, but he did low short, stagger, low short to uh, continue the pressure. Okay, there's the Dawson. There is the Dawson. Yoga fire! Yeah, just like that. Sakura already got meter. Yeah, okay, that's the the hard part here is getting alpha counter. Okay, good block by Saber. Now he's gotta deal with another ambiguous. Yep, couldn't block it that time. Yeah, that's hurting these guys, man. The her ability to get ambiguous uh cross ups on you from you know from her light light into uppercut or her alpha counters it's, it's, it's just it's so annoying to deal with it's very very annoying so OC Rider picking guy to avoid that perfect pick you can also choose Sagat I mean you can still cross him up but it's not that easy either all right, but Saber playing a good job, doing a good job of keeping her away as much as he can. Customs on deck. Should have alpha countered. Get him on the. Oh, okay, good. Why are you listening to me? You just do you, bro. <laughs> I would alpha countered a long time ago and teleported to the other side of the screen. Got out of the corner, but he uses his custom. Now he has no meter. Hokuto, all he has to do is knock him down. Alpha counter, custom, super. Fart on him, whatever it takes. Look at that pressure. Okay, oh, yeah, there. Okay, he's got to deal with the ambiguous cross up. Yes, it is again. No, put herself in the corner, but it's okay. Oh, here's another one. Yep, this is exactly what I'm talking about dealing with the, the hard knockdowns. Staggered the last hit. Look at this pressure. Oh man, what, is, what does Saber have left? No slides or no, no tech rolls. Oh, nice anti air. Nope. Oh, that was from downtown, and Hokuto takes it. Nice play from Hokuto to land and custom. Wow, but it's great play overall by Saber. Wish Saber would have picked Dalsum earlier, so that way uh, he can adapt to the matchup better. But he he tried Chun Li, you know, he tried Chun Li uh, to try to make it work. Uh, but you know, I, I think. Having the Dalsum experience now, it, it, it even though it's on defense, it's, it's pretty whack. His offense, his custom combo abilities, uh, being able to escape certain custom combos because of his teleport tech. You know, Sa Saber, Saber knows how to pick him, man. Very technical. I like that. Okay, next up, we're gonna have. Oh, you know what? We should have played Choi. I, I wouldn't. I didn't go in order. We played loser semis when it should have been loser semis yet. But we played it first. <laughs> we played it first. All right, it's gonna be Choi Boy and OC Rider for winners finals, and they're sitting in the lobby right now. Two. That's the best intro. The best. The best intro. All right, here we go. Zangief, my man. Yes, pick that character. I'm telling you guys. Oh damn! I thought he was gonna pick Zang. I thought he picked Zangief. Pick Zangief. Don't don't pick Ryu. You pick guy. Okay. <laughs> okay. Yo, this is hard. This is a hard ass match. Very hard. Yes, you have to deal with Crouching Fierce to the no no spots. 
Super? No super. Overhead blocked. Okay, it's not so bad so far. So far. But you gotta worry about Ken's damage. Oh, okay, he jumped over him. Ken's damage is still a problem. Oh, he baited the custom. Oh, OC Rider baited the custom. He may have a chance. Oh, he boop, boop, shit flip. Overhead. Okay. All right. <laughs> Yo, he's got to deal with the wall of choice. Yeah, look how much damage he lost already. The trades is not in his favor because uh, John's got the uh, the damage boost. Yeah. There we go. The wake up custom. That's gonna kill. That is gonna kill. Yep, Crouching Fierce hits all of guys jumping. At the worst, he'll trade. At the very worst. Okay, kick throw. Overhead. Oh, okay, so he's going Crouching Medium Kick or Overhead. Oh, John. Oh! Wow, what's going on? What? His controller turn off or what? Did, it, did they desync? No. Uh oh, something's happening. Something's happening. Yeah, like something is definitely happening. Okay, yeah, yeah, we'll 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 figure it out. Hold on. We'll figure out what 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 happened here. What happened? <laughs> hey, dude, what happened? Dude, your stick broke. <laughs> we just fuck with it. The desync. The batteries on the mouse stick died? Oh, you beat OCX? Then the game closed out? Wait, what? Okay, well, what, what happened on OC Rider's side? It desynced. Replay. It's replay from start. It's okay. Yeah, just re re replay from start. It's okay. It's fine. I mean, it it was last game, last round. Let's just let's just have him play it over. Yeah, we saw a guy win, but uh, it desynced from choice side as well. Yeah, they're they're just gonna replay it. It's all good. Yeah, so they're they're gonna replay it from start, so it's it's this is perfectly fine. They they both agreed. Hey, we get more alpha two action. Okay, more alpha two action. Hmm. Okay. And OC Rod is not afraid to doing the Tatsus. Yep, Crouching Fears is always gonna be a problem. Oh, Dizzy off the lights? Oh wow, what a shakeout. What a shakeout. Yeah. Mm. You get more popcorn ready? Oh man, popcorn sounds amazing right now. Why did you have to say popcorn, dude? Now it just makes me think about that dude in Combo Breaker with all those delicious popcorns. It's so amazing. Oh. Yep, Alpha counters. Oh, dude, look, look how much meter John has. Oh, that's he's gonna he's gonna let him have it. Yep, couldn't do anything about that. Now John gets the. Win. <laughs> oh, jeez. My man. Yeah, guy is is. Is is a really really difficult match against Shotos in general because of Crouching Fierce and Fireball. <laughs> Did it desync? No. Probably not. All right, here we go. We got Charlie now. All right, there's more controllable here. Yeah, because Charlie can slow down the match for sure, and he can jump from a far from far distance versus Ken too. Oh, he, dude! He's 
uppercut of the alpha counter. He did the he did the, what's called the Troy Versal. My man is playing out of his mind, dude. This is only a local tournament, John. This is supposed to be an exhibition. <laughs> what are you doing? You showing all the save that shit for Nationals Tech? <laughs> oh my god. Ugh. Sick boom! Mm. Yo, look at the, the distance! Alright, you go. Flash kick. OC Rider is kind of alive now. Doing a little, little bit, little damage as he can. No Sonic boom. No Sonic way. Man, he's got to be careful of throwing fireballs because John can uh, custom through it. Good weight. Oh, that's death. That's two games. That's two games already. Yo, it is. It is a long wall, a tall ass wall that John makes. It's incredible. Rolento. Okay. If you remember, we. Here's my advice. If you play Rolento versus versus John, charge up first. Don't do not play neutral. <laughs> because if you charge up, then he then John can no longer jump at you. You get a free anti-air custom. Then you can kind of play neutral. Cuz he has to deal with your crouching fierces. Oh, no custom anti-air. Now you got to deal Yep, you got to deal with the, the ambiguous there. Ken has one too. Oh, uppercut off the wall things? Oh, knife. Oh, break the kneecaps. Break the kneecaps! Oh, no, you... Old Testament uppercut you back. Woo! Ah, oh, Saber's having problems. anti air customs. Just gotta practice it, my man. Gotta practice it. It, it exists. You do the jump one. Hmm. Yeah, OC Rider's got to get out of this corner. Oh no! Oh, okay, you hit him out. <laughs> you hit him out of the uh, super jump custom. Whoa! All right, OC Rider's still alive. And John has so much meter. A lot of meter. This is gonna hurt. It's gonna hurt so much if he gets the custom. Oh, nice, he converted. Nice. Okay, he baited the custom. Oh, this is looking good now for OC Rider. He doesn't, have, he doesn't have to take in so much damage. Nice. That's what I would keep doing too. Crouching fears for your life. Oh, there it is, he gets the game. Yeah, Crouching fears is a magical button. It's definitely magical. It's magically delicious. Mmm. Yeah, Sable would rather jump custom combo. Hey, you know, whatever whatever works for you, my man. Yeah, but, but my opinion, that anti-air custom from the ground, because no matter what, you have to jump against Rolento. Crouching Fierce and Knives, it just controls too much space. It's better knife than Akuma, a better air fire rolls than Akuma. It's crazy. Yeah, another thing too, once you charge up, you have at least level 2, and somebody throws a fireball at you, Rolento can custom into slide, and you can start your crazy combo from there. There he goes. No, it's not 2-2, two -two because the, the first game that they played was a desync, so they replayed it. Ouch! Yep. You know the <laughs> OC Rider normally rolls a lot, but he doesn't roll from uh, customs or, or combos. Weird. Crouching fierce, nice. John mixing it up with counter pokes. Charge up! You gotta start charging up. Oh, that chip is chip's gonna do it. 
Or unless uh, OC Rider gets a jump in versus a fireball. All John has to do is custom. Oh, okay! It's a custom! Yo! OC Rider takes it from John! Steals it! Makes it 2 2? Just sneaky, sneaky guy here! Woo! He called the Orange County Rider. Hey, you know what? OC Rider is my neighbor. He's like a pebble stone away from me. <laughs> he could probably hear me commentate from here. No, he, he can't. <laughs> Smack! We're Westminster Garden Grove boys. <laughs> oh, look at all that life. Look at all that sangre. I like it. I like it. I like the knife pressure. Oh, no, no standing strong. John trying to find his way out. Custom coming. Woo! The damage! The damage! Yo, John fighting back with the fireballs. Yeah, nice custom combo through the knife. It's all John was looking for. Hmm. Man, John is fighting back. He's showing the people why. He's on top of the leaderboards. This is the match between first number one and two on the leaderboards. Show you again. Nicely done. He did the saber. He did the saber jump custom combo. Man, this is close, man. This is going to the last game, last round. This is this is the the type of match you like to see from one and two. The true rivalry. Hmm. Oh, the custom from John. See, okay. Oh, look, yo, that was so sick. I'm stolen. That is stolen. I'm stole that from the from the archives of OC Rider. Oh, it just. Oh, watch out for the alpha counter. Is can he put Choi into losers or is Choi going to counter poker? Oh, I smell an alpha counter or a custom coming. Alpha counter. Oh, and a jumping fierce and John goes, you know what? I had enough of this. I had enough of this. John moves to grand finals. Oh my goodness, Steve. The roll standing medium custom stolen, dude. I'm gonna I I'm gonna steal that shit right away. That was good. <laughs> oh wow, that was that was so good. Man. I'm not sure if, if uh, OC Rider tried to do anti-air custom or just standing strong, but John got the John got to jump in. That's just the way it works. It's just the way it works sometimes, guys. All right, now we're gonna go losers finals. Losers final. Man, that was that was a pretty high match. Yeah, so I'm t yo, I'm telling you, John. Two of his, his trouble matchups, kinda, Zangief and Rolento. So now you're seeing the the <laughs> Rolento part, right? No, it's rough. It's a rough life. But you got you got to be on point with those characters. You can't just like pick pick up the character in a week and think, oh, I'm gonna be John Choi. All right, here we go. Get him in the match. Oh, that—that that is a nice, beautiful stage we have there. Hmm. Shokin. Shokin. All right, losers finals. Now, you saw that OC Rider put Hokuto into losers with Guy. Now you know the strengths and weaknesses of this. Uh, type of matchup. Take away one of Sakura's main uh, tools, which is the cross up, and you leave her with playing honest footsies on the ground. Is he done? No super? Bushintro, huh? <laughs> you see how uh, Hokuto doesn't even bother going for the cross up there? He just went for the little short. Should have jumped anyways. Just to get out of the corner. Yeah, 
Yeah, he went low this time instead of going for the cross up. Yeah, Hokuto knows now. He goes, I can't cross up this character, so I'm just gonna go for other things. Oh, watch your legs! Watch your legs! Yep, Guy may have the the quickest standing medium kick uh, custom, but he also has a very fat, very fast crouching medium kick one. It doesn't go as far, but it can still catch you. Low. Oh, standing medium kick. Oh, he did the bunny condo rapid fire across the medium kick. Oh, that looked like a punish. That definitely looked like a punish. Oh, meaty elbow. Yeah, Hokuto has to figure this out. It's not easy. Not an easy matchup at all. Oh, Rose? Yep. Oh, you, you know what? Rose would have been definitely been a better a better pick because because then you could do punch alpha counters and guy has no projectiles so oh okay Shoken. jumping fierce oh no oh you missed that misses on soccer what so he can't do two jabs or he did the roundhouse late huh Jumping custom. All right, kick throw overhead, nice. Hokuto has to find his way out. He's got full full meter. All right, no, he's not gonna go for cross. Just straight in. Oh, custom. Should have custom. You gotta optimize the the punishes. Okay, empty jump throw broke. Oh, the display of weight here. Nice alpha counter by OC Rider. Yeah, LC Ray is really good with the alpha counters, man. And, and, and fight Kate is it's not that easy. Nice counter custom by Hokuto. Yep, no rolls. Oh, he still rolls because he doesn't care. Yeah, he still doesn't do anti air customs. Interesting. Yeah, he basically. Oh, wow, baiting the custom into an elbow drop. Oh, oh wow! What a punish! Ah oh, man, the exchange, the exchange there was just bad luck. Oh, that was bad luck by Hokuto, man. Like it was, it was going in her way, and she just barely missed the button and got custom for it. It happens, you know. Scramble opportunities like that—it's very scary in this game because if you do with any mediums, or especially fierces. Customs are, are legit punishes for those. Mm. Ow, ow. Yeah, OC Rider with the total control in this match. Standing medium kick. Such a great poke. Alright, here's Hokuto's chance. Look at the constant jumpings. No anti airs by, uh, by OC Rider. Oh, he got dizzy! He steals it from him! Wow. Interesting. So, you know I said earlier that Guy, another perk or feature from Guy is he can just walk out of your jumping pressure. Like, if you do short and stagger, whatever, just hold forward and walk through your jumping. It's... <laughs> and then he puts you in the corner. Oh, Hokuto's doing a great job of... of uh, Tra uh, keeping OC Raiden near the corner. Alpha counter, nice. A little bit of a trade there, but you know, so it works. Yep, make make some burn his custom. Nice. And Hokuto's on the board. There we go. He's cut. He's cut. <laughs> OC Raiden's cut, and it's a bad cut. <laughs> It's no holes bars here in the Alpha 2 Wednesday Night Fights Tournament. <laughs> if you know the reference, you might be OG. Oh, he picks Zangief. Oh, he wants to end it out now. He's like, alright, that's, that's a wrap, guys. Hmm. Actually, th this match is uh, not bad for Sakura. It's not, it's not that bad. <laughs> she 
She definitely has the tools here. Oh man. Oh, Crouching Fierce, yep. Yeah, good block. Oh, stolen! Take the hit and throw! Take the hit and throw, the classic special. Shogun! Yeah, no, no rolling. No roly polies for you! Good anti air custom. Eef! Alright, Zengi with the full meter. Ugh, so much damage. How is he gonna spend this meter though? Is he gonna custom or is he gonna do final atomic buster? Level 3. Punch up a counter. Man, punch up. Oh! Punch up a counter is amazing stuff. Oh, he spends all of his meter. It's not looking good. Not looking good. Man, she drops so fast. Boo boo! Man, it's almost even here. Yeah, OC Ryder trying to finish it off. Oh, he got <laughs> countered by the short. And Hokuto ties it up. Look at this. Look at this turn of events, man. I'm telling you. Sakura versus Zangief is not that bad. It's definitely not that bad. Okay, here we go. Oh, Rolento. Saber needs to watch this. To see if his... If if, if 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 the fate is the same, you know, like Rolento could be doing well 99% of the time, but if he gets knocked down once, that is game. That is game, game, game. Or thrown. Now look at this knife pressure by OC Ryder. Yep, couldn't. Oh, couldn't strong it. Yep, cross up. One more, probably dizzy. No alpha counter. Okay, off to use custom. There you go. Ooh, this is still looking close. Counter custom. Oh, jumped in fierce. Yep, one more for dizzy. Good, there it is. And Hokuto, just like that, ties it up. Now we're going to the final, final game here between these guys. Is it going to be Hokuto going to Grand Finals or OC Raida? Oh, punishment? No, no punishment. He made him waste all his meter. Oh, this is not a really good position. He gets the knockdown. Hokuto is making his way in. Jumping strong, nice air to air. Uh, custom is still not uh, converting. Uh, jumping light, jumping fierce. Everything's working right now for Hokuto. He got him in the corner. Plus, oh, nice jump in custom. Oh, what a bait! I think that's it, and Hokuto takes it. <laughs> I couldn't keep up, dude. I'm telling you, man. OC Riders got that quick turn off button. Oh. Boy, oh boy. <laughs> GG's. GG's, man. Good games. It went to it went to the wire. It's just uh Yeah, OC Rider picking all of his all of his bag of tricks. I'm surprised he didn't even try like Chun Li. It, yeah, he, he went with uh, Guy, you know, he we went with, and and he should have stuck with Guy, too. You know, uh, that, that character gives her a lot of problems. And then he went uh, Zangief, which is actually a pretty decent match. And then he went to Rolento, which it, it's kind of one of those, like, don't put yourself in a bad situation, you know. <laughs> After all your work. And here we are, you know, with Choi and Hokuto. And this is uh 
Gonna be the grand final match. You know, these guys have played once before. They've danced once before. I think that, you know, this is uh, more of a match for Hokuto to, to prove that he is going to bring it home for the new school. This is Choi's second grand final um, appearance this weekend. <laughs> or this weekend. <laughs> yeah, the Wednesday's the weekend, bro. Yeah. So, <laughs> tonight, Super Turbo, uh, he got in grand finals, but he didn't win that one. Super B got it. And now he's in grand final versus Hokuto. And before we get into the grand final match, uh, let's show people where we are in the leaderboards. All right, so Choi Boy is pretty much our Street Fighter Alpha 2 uh, Vitrix Winter Season Champion. So congratulations to him. Like he's he's in Grand Finals. I mean, he was over like 50 points away from uh, Ryda. Uh, Ryda, you know, still second place, but really strong showing. And then Slam Town, you got to, dude, you, you can't miss the signups, bro. <laughs> he, he missed the signups this week. Because uh, signups closed at 6.30. But it's still, he, he's, he did such an entertaining showing throughout the entire season. So it's, it's a great showing. And then Hokuto is sitting in fourth. And he, he's he's looking his way to, to tie Slamtown. If he wins the tournament, he ties with Slamtown. So, but it's all about what happens next too. Okay? So between these two players, uh, there's still a tournament to, to win tonight. Even though Choi has already secured the bag for with the headset. Don't tell me they played. Okay. <laughs> I was going to say, don't tell me they played. Like, wait, what? You guys... <laughs> you see my face like, huh? All right, here we go. Grand finals. Grand finals, baby. Oh, got to change the names. Ding. Oh, did they desync? Ah, uh, I think so. Yeah, desync. Yep. Desync remake. It's the most recent desyncs I've seen. Yep. Again. He says swap names. Yes, we will. We will. We will swap names. Don't worry, we'll get there. We'll get there. <sighs> Alright, we're here. Grand finals times. Oh, let me get that water. Let me get that water. Oh, okay. Hadouken! And John already has the <laughs> the meter life lead. Remember I said like Street Fighter is a game played by slivers? John is showing you <laughs> what that means. Either you're gaining meter by slivers or you're winning by slivers of life. Full life now. Look at this. Meter. He's going to do lots of damage now. I mean, Hokuto can still do a lot of damage. But he couldn't find his way. John was ready. Okay, he got the overhead. Oh my god, that hurt. Oh, he could alpha counter that too. Yeah, John, all he has to do is alpha counter. Oh, he ate, an, he ate a jump in. Wait, crouching fear? Oh, did it desync again? Wait, what? Wait, that was weird. Okay, no, I thought it desynced again. That was weird because he used. Low, low shorting on a jump in. <laughs> there we go. Nice alpha. Alpha counter of his own. Yeah, razor sharp fireball. Yep. Cr crouching fierce. Uh, Shoto's got all the good anti airs in the, in the classics. Oh, ambiguous? Yes. Will he tech? Yes, he techs! And Hokuto gets the last sneaker. 
He hit her with the sneaker to Dizzy John. Yeah, that's the scary part about Sakura. Like, should you tech roll or not from this after getting DP? Hmm. Oh, jump in. One more combo, probably you can dizzy him. Alright, time has passed. Oh, look at this pressure, it's so relentless. Nice! Got the damage. Hmm. Nice uppercut. Yeah, John was cocking that like crazy, dude. Like a shotgun. Oh, this is... Oh, he blocks it. What? Tatsu? <laughs> Yo, we do this on multiple games? Doing this in Super Turbo and now Alpha 2? There we go. John customs through the fireball. Gotta pay. That did so much damage. And Hokuto with a custom of his own. Baby damage. Baby damage, but he got some. Does he tech? Oh, good block by John. Ooh, kicked in the face. Yeah, that time, uh, Hokuto guessed right on the jump in, but John blocked it. That would have been scary times. <laughs> that would have been scary, scary times. <sighs> Alright, game three. Man, still on point with the uppercuts. Like, it never goes out of style. Yeah, dude, John coming back like old Steve Rogers. And the Young Bucks ask him, Hey, uh, how do you still uppercut like that? Can you, can you, can you show us how? And John be like, No, I don't think I will. <laughs> he said, Save that shit for national, son. <laughs> Damn! The damage! Yatere! Mm. That doesn't miss, dude! The macros are on point! Uppercut! Yeah, the medium uppercut is so satisfying to land in this game. Yeah, I gotta inch his way in closer. Uppercut, yep. Okay, he clips his legs. But now what? Oh, he made John use his custom. Okay, that's good. That's really good for Hokuto. Because that's where the damage would have sealed the deal for this round. But he's still got to worry about the onslaught of uh, fireballs. Oh, no. Uppercut. Oh, no. You might not get a chance to get in again. Oh, how are you going to get to the wall of John? Oh, no. He could have... Oh, he just did fierce uppercut. So, so smart. Because John had no more life to give. I don't think John was ready to alpha counter at all. Nicely done. Oh, good block. Oh, John was ready. He knows. He knows. No, you're going to jump right after my alpha counter. Crouching fierce for you into your no-no spots. Mm. <laughs> he has no idea what's happening. Hey, dude, it's a lot of scrambles. This alpha too. Does he jump or does he tech roll? Nice jump. Ambiguous. Dizzy. Super? Yep. Get the knockdown. Damage. Oh, the delayed fireball. Nicely done. And Hokuto up two. Hey. Hey now. Hey now. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, this could be Hokuto's tournament to win. He hasn't won a Alpha 2 tournament yet. So this would be a really, really good, uh, big milestone for him to win uh, versus one of the best ever to play this game. Hmm. Okay. And relentless. Oh, again! Light, light! Yo, Hokuto sees something in the Matrix. He definitely sees something in the Matrix. Nice fireball. Gotta watch out for the custom. The custom can clip his legs. Oh, he does a super. John just, John just blocks. Yo, the balls of steel. 
Oh, he staggered the shorts in the custom? Yo, who the hell is this guy? No way that's John playing. Yo, that is crazy. We, I've never seen him do that. He staggered the lights? What? <laughs> Damn, dude. He doesn't want the young blood to win at all. That was so sick. Oh, what a jump in by Hokuto. Overhead, yes, but block. John was ready. Oh, and he walked him out the throw. Ambiguous is coming. Yup, John can't block that. One more hit for getting stunned. Oh, good block by John. Oh, no alpha counter. Oh, he customs through it. Nice. Nice. John can't get a... John couldn't throw a fireball from that range. Maybe that was planned. Now he has no meter. Yep, there he goes. All part of the plan. Already down 60% life and back to the wall. What you gonna do? What you gonna do, brother? I got you for three minutes. It's playtime. Oh, yeah. Oh, no jumping. Oh, custom. It's coming in. Mm. Oh, put the legs. And John ties it up. John ties it up. Yo, he, he is not going down without a fight. Definitely not going down without a fight. Shout out to Bonesaw. <laughs> Shout out to Bonesaw. If you know that reference, you might be OG. Mm. Hadouken! Oh, Tatsu. Yes, nice tick throw. Ambiguous time. Good block. Oh, okay, you got the mix up there. Another ambiguous. Oh, blocked from the front side this time. Yo, the pressure. Hmm. Yeah, Hokuto is playing this matchup like it's Street Fighter V. Just keep jumping until it works. And it's working. Like, he's okay eating eating the uppercut damage. Because if Sakura gets just one jump in, it's a potential set play opportunity. Oh, but now he's got to worry about the Dizzy and Alpha counter damage. Hadouken! Oh, super! What are you going to do about that, old man? Super to the face. Balls to the face. Big blue balls to the face. Hmm. Hadouken! Hmm. Okay, John's got the full meters. No, no custom combo for anti-air. They both got full stick of meter. Oh man, somebody's gonna get hurt. Somebody's gonna make a, de a huge deposit to the Red Cross. I'm telling you, a huge deposit. The biggest. It's coming. It's still coming. Oh, the blocks. Oh, wait, wait, what? Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, don't take. Yeah. John ties it up. Alright, look. This is tournament point for John, and this is reset point for Hokuto. Hokuto's got the meter lead. Fireball to the face, jump in. Oh, John's ready with the medium kick. Making his distance, he's trying to gain meter. Hokuto's not giving him a chance. Hokuto will eat the custom? Okay, he does. Oh, he clipped his legs, he clipped his legs. Oh, John Yui, John counter throws. John's got meter. Oh, he tried it. I respect it. He tried it, but it wasn't enough. And John Choi custom combos his way to win Alpha 2. That was a great match. Oh, that that was a great match. Ooh, that was... Dude, Hokuto played out of his mind. The, the, the decision-making on his part... To keep the pressure on, eat the anti-airs because he knows if he lands just <laughs> one neck kick in a dream, that could be a wrap. Because Sakura does insanely high stun damage and just combo damage in general. So, good play. And he knew that, like, okay, John has a little meter, he'll, he'll eat the custom. Or he'll eat the alpha counter. So, I like the way, I like the way of thinking there. That That's... That's something that I actually did, like with, with Ryu. When I okay, when I play Ryu versus Ken, I've told this story before, and I'm tired of getting, I'm tired of just not doing things versus Ken when he has meter. So I just throw fireballs and I let him custom me, or not sorry, not custom. I would let him alpha counter me because he would have one bar or two bar, and then I would make it, I would let it rain, and then anytime he tried to do a counter fireball or anything, then I custom back and I win. So. It, it works this way with Hokuto's game plan of like, oh, okay, I don't care if I'm getting hit by level one 
Ken whatever. Super alpha counter, custom. Because by the time that I get to you, I can seal the deal. <laughs> yeah, and that that's that's what was going on, man. That was that was great. Hokuto's pressure was so good. And the the movement getting in too, was like she's like wave dashing his way in. That's when I knew he had he had a really good control of, of how he's getting through these matchups. So man, it was this top eight, man. Oh, and and uh super turbo. Fuck, dude. I'm I'm uh I'm a little sad, right? Yeah, well, a little, little, but uh, but happy at the same time because you know it's uh, I, I get to see you know great play from you guys, but um, you know as mentioned before, if you guys weren't around for the Super Turbo, uh, top eight, uh, I, I made an announcement where hold on, can't even see the there we go. Uh, I, I made an announcement where we are. Uh, we finished with the season of Super Turbo and Alpha 2 for uh, the Vitrix Winter Season. But um, I need to move the games to Tuesdays, to finish on Tuesdays now. Because I can't do <laughs> six hours on Wednesdays because I have a little a, a little one on the way. So, um, But however, how it's going to work on Tuesdays is not both games are not going to be played at uh, consecutively uh, now. Uh, they're going to rotate. So it's going to be a bi-weekly effort. So next week, we'll start with Super Turbo. They'll play their full tournament uh, on, on Tuesday. And then the week after that, it will be Alpha 2's turn. So it will alternate that way. Um, I will update you guys when and if uh, more action, more classic action returns on on uh, Wednesday. But for now, you know, I, I got to I gotta make room for it. The, uh, the family man stuff. So, um, But yeah, that'll do it, guys. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching Alpha 2 and Super Turbo. Uh, I am going to pass it along to uh, the Street Fighter V folk shortly. So let me prepare this real quick. Oh, man. I get to eat some of my leftover pizza from lunch today. I'm happy. <laughs> but, yeah, that's it, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching uh, Street Fighter V coming up next. Take care.